From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Rory Johnston. Here are the latest headlines. A person's been shot. It happened at a gas station in Columbia, and it was close to Spring Hill High School. The incident happened this afternoon at the Shell Station on Nashville Highway. So both Spring Hill Middle and High Schools were placed briefly on hard lockdown. That has since been lifted. The victim was airlifted to a nearby hospital. His or her condition is not known, but a suspect does remain at large in the case. We'll keep you updated. As he's getting ready for his new role next month, Governor-elect Bill Lee stopped to congratulate the THP's new graduating class. The cadets received awards, scholarships, and keys to their new patrol cars. The governor-elect thanked law enforcement for their service and gave the new graduates encouraging words. More than 400 students will be warmer this holiday season thanks to Genesco's Cold Feet Warm Shoes event. 29th year for this community outreach event, providing the students from Park Avenue Elementary with a new pair of Adidas shoes and a warm hat. A mock shoe store was set up right in the school's gym. Volunteers individually measured each child's foot and matched them with the correct shoe size. More than 75,000 pairs of shoes have been donated since the program was formally established in 1989. This weekend, though, you'll likely need an umbrella, Bree. Yeah, definitely that. Maybe the rain shoes. Good to see the smiles on those kids' faces. The good news is the rain will only linger for the first part of the weekend. It is our fourth weekend in a, in a row that will have some rain in it, but it's not going to be a washout, and we're not going to have the wintry mess we had last weekend. Mercury doesn't move much either. You wake up to 50 tomorrow, and we top out at 57 on Saturday in the warmest locations. Some sunshine pokes through on Sunday. We'll call that the pick day of your weekend. Get outside. Nice mild weather through most of next week.